Solana is unreliable and Ethereum is too expensive, G-Monad. Today, we're diving deep into the world of Monad, the new layer one blockchain that could revolutionize the blockchain landscape with fast transactions and low costs. Stay tuned to learn how Monad makes Solana and Ethereum look outdated. And at the end, I also have an insider tip for you on how to qualify for the biggest airdrop of 2024. In this video, I talk about the technology behind Monad the team, the ecosystem, and insider information, I took a look behind the scenes for you. Full transparency, I'm an active community member and would like to get more involved with Monad to be at the forefront of a promising new project. Monad is an EVM compatible layer one blockchain designed for extreme performance with 10,000 transactions per second. What does EVM compatibility mean? App portability, easy development, and an optimal environment for decentralized apps. And the best part, it's like Ethereum, only better. With the mission to create a decentralized solution with high throughput and low transaction costs, Monad directly challenges established players like Solana and other layer ones. The goal, solve developer problems, achieve massive user adoption and overtake centralized solutions. Monad prepares the blockchain ecosystem for mass adoption with support for 50 million users and the ability to handle enough transactions per user, Monad is the platform for widespread crypto adoption. How does Monad achieve the impressive speed? Through parallel and asynchronous execution, optimization at all levels and a rethought consensus and execution model. A bold promise of speed that brings with it a major challenge in blockchain development. With 100 to 200 validators at launch, Monad balances and decentralization, security, and performance. It's efficient and sufficiently decentralized for a start. All three points of the blockchain trilemma are not balanced from the start. But unfortunately, compromises must be made between decentralization, scalability, and security. Monad mirrors Ethereum's computation layer, simplifies the development of the apps, leverages Ethereum's network effects, and minimizes the entry effort. It is similar yet advanced. Monad supports all EVM wallets such as Metamask, Rabi, Ledger and operates with smart contracts just like Ethereum. Additional exclusive features are planned to make it user-friendly from day one. A massive argument for the validity of the project in my opinion is definitely that Paradigm, the big VC fund, currently leads a 200 million funding round for Monad Labs. Till now, Monad just got about 19 million in funding back in February 2023. And with 200 million, that would actually be one of the biggest funding rounds in this bull market so far and in 2024. Paradigm itself plans to contribute 150 million to this funding round. On the website, you can see uh, some of the founders, uh, especially uh, the CEO, Keon, for example, with his face. Uh, James, the co-founder and CTO, and Yunus, the COO. And you can also connect with them via LinkedIn. They give you their profile. That's definitely a nice advantage compared to anonymous teams. It We're dealing with an experienced team of top tech companies. They even show their faces. This creates trust and transparently shows us the team's expertise. From DeFi to utility to NFTs, Monad is home to innovative projects like Nitro Finance, Shrimp Dex, MagmaDAO, and many more. There are already numerous projects under construction, even though the blockchain is not even live yet. Do you want to be part of Monad's success? then you should join the official Discord community and exchange ideas with like-minded people. You're still early. In the Monad Discord, there is a lot happening. First of all, they have uh, many events every week. Uh, for example, a poker round. Uh, they are hosting Twitter spaces. They have uh, different uh, tourneys. So definitely participate in these and uh, be present there. Then you'll start in the newbie chat. Uh, that's basically the spam channel. Just say hello, connect to people, play games. Uh, they are doing quizzes every day, basically. So uh, that can be a nice uh, variation of the common airdrop farming that we are doing in crypto all the time right now. And if you're more into real the crypto uh, topics, trading, uh, for example, uh, sharing something about the technology of different uh, crypto projects, then the uh, newbie tech and trade uh, channel is your go-to channel. Uh, you can also be active there and contribute. It's actually more fun for me, at least. I don't like the spam all the time. 
And uh, you should uh, definitely be uh, creative and uh, participate actively in creating memes, uh, for example, creating tweets, uh, mantras, everything here. Every two hours, you can uh, create something in this newbie create channel. Yeah, uh, the team uh, is saying that they actively check this uh, channel a lot. So if you want to get into the insider circle, you should be active. Of course, I was creative myself and uh, created some funny uh, memes. You can see them here. Just take something that uh, already exists and adapt it to Monad. It actually is time in intensive to farm all of this, but it might be worth it. And they uh, have these uh, funny hats here. Uh, you should add them to your profile picture in Discord, in the uh, Monad Discord. They ha you have a special profile over there where you can add an info, uh, some description about what you're doing, what kind of uh, person you are, and uh, also this hat here. Don't forget to ring the bell and hit that subscribe button for the best airdrop opportunities and DeFi insights. See you on the other side.